morning. Right, back in the field. Now today, normally I cover this area, especially this area. And the horseshoe I found down there. You can see the river running around there in the horseshoe shape as well. On that little, it's called a cape, if that was the ocean. But yeah, and on that little thing, that's where I'm heading today. So I'm, I'm going down this hill. Anyway, the first find, well I'm in the process of taking it out, is something big. At this stage it looks like a... Oh, it's coming. I'm just going to loosen it up a bit more. But it just looks like a piece of iron. Don't know yet. Okay. Well, as I suspected, just a piece of iron. Could have been uh, a band going around the barrel. Since I've got a little half a hole there. But yeah, nothing special. I'll pick that up on my way back. Down the hill we go! So I've come down the hill. Sweep this area, found nothing but wire, and uh, starting to get uh, demotivated really. To climb that hill again is going to cause me to breathe like an old ox having um, trouble, trouble breathing. <laughs> anyway, and then I came across this little signal. Now I'm going to attempt a live deck. Let's find the signal again. That's a nice, nice clear signal for this area. Let me just move that glass, flatten the glass. Ah. Where is it now? There you go. And it's not very deep. Let's try this. Okay, it's right there. Let's see what happens. One hand it. One hand band it. One arm band it, damn it. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Now is it still in the hole or is it in the plug? That's deep. Still in the hole. Um let's see what the pinpointer says. Oh man, it's deep. Then it must be something big as well. Uh -uh. Okay, I'm gonna have to shut off. Uh, I'll keep you posted. Bear with me. Well, the very next scoop, and ain't not black some. Ah. Guys, there, there you've got it. Wear gloves, damn it. Ah, oh, man. Okay, let's see if I can show you this. Should be able to see a little round item there. If the focus would just play along. I've got no idea what this is. I haven't touched it yet. It looks like a coin. Or a button. It's a coin. Oh, yes! It's a half cent. An old half cent. <sighs> Oh man, this is fantastic! <laughs> no wonder I couldn't find it. I thought it was deep, it's just really, really small. <laughs> okay, it's a bit crusted on this side. Uh, I have to clean it to get a date of it. Um, off of it, damn it. Um, I'll get back to you. Awesome! I came down to the river and gave it a little rinse, but. Uh, I don't know if it's going to focus. There you can see it now. 1970. A bit younger than I expected. But these are so rare. You really have a hard time finding them. Been out of circulation for a long time. You can see the two... Uh, I think it's... I've oh, got no idea what kind of birds those are. But yeah, half cent. Great stuff. Yeah, it's getting hot. Oh, this has been at least eight inches. 
Yeah, at least this massive piece of iron. Now this thing is hollow in the middle of, of course. Um, I suspect, I've seen this before in the museum. This was attached to the end of a flagpole. Maybe a standard carried by a horseman. So it acted as, this would also sheath into a leather pouch in the saddle. And uh, because it was made out of iron, it could also be used for a, for a weapon if, uh, if need arose. So yeah, this is an awesome find. See you at the next. Well, as most of you guys know, when you go out, you, you find all sorts of stuff. Come over, hey, hey, come, 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 come. I just have to stop the dogs because this is what I discovered on my way to the spot I'm going to detect. Look at that. It looks like a material bag and the inside is a, a dog skull. And recently this area was burnt. So somebody just dumped their dog here. And uh, the skull was uncovered, but well, it's, it's, it's been here for quite a while, I can see by the decay. But uh, still, it's upsetting for me. I would have buried my dog. So yeah. Anyway. Let's let's get cracking. Can't be upset by this. Alright guys, the next find. I haven't found one of these in a while. Right, let's take a look. Okay, there is some writing on it. Um, can't really make out at this stage, but I'm gonna have to clean it. But we found uh, these ones before. Um, actually, this one. I don't recognize the motive or the decorations. Okay, I'll clean it up at home, show you. Man, I almost walked over this signal. Not even an inch deep. Look there, it looks like another button. Yeah, it is. Let's uh, just drop the soil there and see what we see, what we can find out about this thing. Oh, okay, now it looks pretty blank. Yeah, it's pretty blank. I'll have to clean it up and I'll show you at home. Now I told you a while back that somebody else has been uh, visiting this site and not filling their holes, like here's a good example. See, this hole is deep. I uh, hope I can give you some sort. Well, it's at least three inches still deep. So I, I'm going to have to close this blooming hole. But it also got its advantages. Here's another hole, hasn't been filled. And for some reason, the detectorist, if I want to call this person one, forgot to take the prize. There. This is a fired Henry Martini. Martini Henry. Damn, I keep on switching the names. A Martini Henry. Bullet point. Uh, the sun is really bright. Doesn't want to focus. But um, this is a nice one. You can see the impact damage. This end would go into the cartridge. That point, uh, would have been the impact point. Nice. Now I don't know what this is yet. It looks like lead, and uh, it's quite firm in there. Okay, uh, let's see. Whoa, what's this? something lead hmm a rivet but why would it be made out of lead oh man this is a weird find okay I'm gonna clean it up uh, I'll show them wait a minute okay now oh, there you can see it's a rivet it looks like a rivet ah. uh, 
Oh, it's lead. Man, this looks... Could this have been a stamp? No. Okay, I'll check it out. I'll, I'll see, show you in the roundup. Look at this big boy. Whoo! Man. What is this used for? One big tent pen. Tent anchor, maybe? Must have been. Wow! Heavy. At least three pounds. Right! This signal was pretty hard to pinpoint. And I have just seen a little rim there. If I could just see it through the viewfinder there. Don't know what it is yet. Might be something, might be nothing. Well, it's some sort of a cap. Maybe a button? Huh? <laughs> okay, at this stage, it's blank. Uh, well, that hole doesn't go through, which suggests... Suggests... That it's a button. There's some motive coming through now. Wow, this is an interesting one. That actually looks like a... <laughs> Uh, I don't think you'll be able to see it at this moment. Let me just try and... Oh dear. See, it looks like a cannabis leaf. <laughs> okay, I'm going to clean this up. Brilliant. So I'm on my way back. Felt like I'm done for the day. And uh, came across this weird signal. It was jumping all over the place. Even had iron in it. And I think by this angle... You should be able to see something. <clears throat> look at that. There's a room there. And look at that. There's something there. So, a double whammy. Let me just zoom out a bit. Okay, let's see. I think I know what's going on here. Okay, it's one button. Oh, shit. It's destroyed. Oh, no. <sighs> Oh well, and as you can see it was my fault, it is my fault, manhandled. Uh, okay, well it's interesting to see how the the, the loop is, is secured on the inside. I'm going to try and get the rest of it, oh, I'm disappointed. Alright, so I was scratching around, cursing myself, and look at this, clay pipe, and it looks freshly broken. So I broke this as well. And look at this. A Martini Henry bullet split in two. What the hell? There's another piece of the clay pipe. Same hole. Now there's something here. Okay, I'm going to continue to try and salvage this hole. Uh, what's this? Oh, there's the rest of the button. Okay, it's a general service button. This one would have been in great condition. Let's see if I can get the focus. 